Well, hello, friends. Hey, it's David here with Philippine American Couple, The Adventures Up. That's us right here. If you would do me the favor of subscribing to our channel, sharing, liking, and hitting that alert bell, we'd greatly appreciate it. This video about watches is going to be something a little different. So uh, I found this is the cheapest watch I can find on the internet. And we're going to destroy this watch. This is what we're going to do. I want to show you guys what's inside of the cheapest watch that I could find. Now, if you're wondering how much is cheap, well, 31 cents is what I paid for this watch. So why don't we see, I got my trusty tool kit here. Let me see if I can get some tools out here. So you see my nice little tool kit. Why don't we first just, uh, I'll show you what this is. So I think the band is paper. I think this is just like paper. It's not leather. Um, I don't even think it's real fabric, but we're gonna check that out. And here's your buckle. Here's where your holes are. Here's what it's called, Sirius Aware RC. It's the cheapest watch I can find. And I got a bunch of these if you guys want to buy any. So, um, and they work okay, but it is truly the cheapest watch I can find on the internet. So let's uh, see if we can pop the back off. That was easy. Uh, so it did have a little rubber gasket on it which is good for 31 cents, right? It doesn't feel like it would work really well, but there you go. So the little plate has nothing on it, and there's your back. It's pretty tough. Let's get... Uh, some tweezers here. So here's what we got in the back of it. So our mechanism is really, 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 really small. And as you guys know, you can just gently pop those little cheap plastic rings out, which are spacers. And my eyes aren't really good, and this is really hard to see, but there is going to be a little screw right here that would allow you to take this stem out. Okay? But let's see what, if we can... We're gonna manhandle this. Like I said, I only paid 31 cents. So let me see if I can get in here and see how good of a quality this thing is. Okay. Here's our pins. So the pins are normal pins. Uh, what you'd find in most, you know, level watches here. Let me So remember our band I said I thought it was made out of paper Why don't we cut it open and just see If we can find out what this thing is made out of Hopefully I won't cut myself there we go so here's what the inside of the band looks like so this black part here You know, it's pretty tough, guys. It's actually pretty good. Here's the inside of the band. See, this green stuff to me felt like paper. A little bit of cardboard right in here.
yeah, this is just paper or cardboard there. And I guess this green stuff, the outer layer, is a fabric. It's kind of like denim. Okay, so that's what the band looks like. Let's get back up here and show you the back. So, the case. Now, I'm just gonna snap this apart because I don't have good enough eyeballs at the moment. So here's your frame. Take that out. Let's see how strong it is. Okay. Now here's the face, right? So this one happens, you know, just to be a tree frog watch. Here's our simple little hands. And these are very simple little hands. This frog, just a sticker. Yeah. We do have a little battery. The battery's no good in these. So if you guys have ever been wondering what's inside of a watch, um, well, I wanted to share this with you on a really, really cheap watch that didn't cost me any money. So this is the mechanism. And if you have good enough eyes, right there's a screw. And maybe I can do that. Get the right, get the little screwdriver out. You could pop the stem out and take these out and do whatever you want with them. Put them in other watches if you wanted to do that. Here's the face, the frog. Here's the back of it couple pins where uh, this part was on. There's our crystal. Actually feels like real glass. So I'm actually quite impressed with my 30 cent watch. What do you guys think? All right, just kind of a fun little video. Remember uh, to keep watching, keep enjoying watches and collecting, buying and selling and trading. And of course, if you didn't know, that's what I do. I just think watches are fascinating. So if you ever see anything I have that you might be interested in, uh, reach out to me. You know, our information's there on the, on the YouTube page. And I would love to hear from you what you guys think about the mess I made out of this 30, I think I paid 32 cents for this watch off of eBay. So, um, all right guys, thanks again.